think the biggest successes so far are in particular the move, the actual move in on the day went flawlessly. Um, I've never seen a hospital move lock, stock and barrel within 24 hours and we pulled that off really well. So for us the biggest successes since we arrived at the Northumbria is the significant increase in deliveries. We've experienced an increase of around 100 women more per month coming in to have their babies with us. As a cardiologist, ready access to echocardiography has made a huge difference in terms of diagnosis and management and having the specialist nurses there who can then facilitate the early diagnosis, early management, early discharge of patients has made a huge difference. We've been able to give much faster diagnostic testing which has had a big impact. The clinicians all have found the service excellent. For the patient it means they often get a full diagnosis before they even leave emergency care. One of the biggest challenges that we've had is getting people to the right place. It's a completely different system that we have now and people are used to going to certain hospitals for certain things. Getting people up to speed with the, the new way of working, with the faster pace of working on the acute unit, um, working jointly with accident and emergency with the ED department. I think it's, it's learning to work with new teams, new ways of working, um, quick turnaround, having up to 20 patients discharged in one shift. We've never had that before, so a lot quicker turnover like an emergency admission ward. This building has received, on average through the winter, about 820 ambulances a week. That is more than we'd ever expected. It's the highest in the region. The flow of patients, because it's so efficiently designed um, and has such fantastic diagnostics, has made a real difference to the experience that patients get. Quicker access to imaging, uh, quicker access to specialty opinions has been a real bonus. Um, for patients, it means that they're not waiting in line with non-emergencies for their investigations. Historically, patients would have waited four to five days. Um, we are now consistently operating on patients within 24 hours. For folk with heart attacks, so these, the ones that we look after for the management of those patients since Cramlington opened, our survival has dramatically improved. Marvellous, it's like a five-star hotel. It's a great hospital, it's, um, it's well run. The staff are excellent and it's, it's on a par with the private hospital which I have had uh, treatment at. Oh, it's lovely. So it's like luxury. It's better than some bed and breakfasts you go to. You know what I mean? The bedrooms and masses, you've got your own bathroom and stuff like that, and, and the nurse and staff are really helpful in that. So, yes, really nice. I would recommend it to anybody. Well, for the year ahead, we're really excited. We've recruited three new staff, um, two to work from here and one from one spec, so we can cover more wards more often. And we're also hoping to integrate the other teams in the community into the hospital a little bit more. Um, to improve and refine our systems and processes to make the, the process of a patient coming at the hospital slicker and quicker. I think we've got quite a lot of ambition for the coming year. We can't rest on our laurels. We can't just say we've done that bit and that's it. So. We've been working hard as part of the Vanguard process across Northumberland to look at how we access primary care and work more closely with primary care. Whatever happens over the next few years in Northumbria will be continuing to change and it will be about that continuous improvement journey. This was set up to deliver fantastic seven day emergency care. It works absolutely amazingly. I feel like I've been part of one of the biggest changes that we've been able to do. I'm happy to stand up anywhere and talk about what we've achieved. I've always been really proud of my team because they always go above and beyond to help individuals. They always make sure that the patient comes first. You know, received an outstanding CQC rating, brand new hospital first in the country, phenomenal. It has been one of the greatest thrills of my entire professional career.